It has been announced that the second season of Meghan Markle's Spotify podcast Archetypes won't be renewed as the audio provider starts to make adjustments and reorganize its offerings. In a joint statement on Thursday night, the streaming behemoth and Meghan Markle and Prince Harry's audio production business Arkwell Audio said they had mutually agreed to part ways and are proud of the series we made together. The Wall Street Journal stated that Meghan and her husband Harry allegedly agreed to a $20 million contract with Spotify for the project in late 2020, but insiders close to the music service believe the royal pair did not exceed the productivity target necessary to collect the entire amount. The decision to cancel the Duchess of Sussex's program, which examines labels that try to hold women back, comes after conversations about continuing it for a second season months ago. The tenacious Duchess, however, is determined to continue producing podcasts and find a new home for her show, which has already included music icon Mariah Carey, tennis ace Serena Williams, and South African comic Trevor Noah. The cancellation of the program follows reports from individuals close to the Duke and Duchess of Sussex that they will quit producing scathing Netflix docuseries, writing memoirs, and participating in interviews that criticize the royal family because they have nothing left to say. Following the conclusion of the first season, it was reported that Spotify began talks about a second season of Archetypes, but those talks eventually halted. The WSJ received the following statement from WME, the talent agency that just signed Megan. The team behind Archetypes remain proud of the podcast they created at Spotify. For the audience of Archetypes, Megan is still creating additional material on another platform. The week after its debut, the podcast topped Spotify's rankings. Mail in Line has been in touch with Spotify, Archwell, and WME. It happens at the same time that Spotify revealed it would be firing 200 employees from its podcast teams, or around 2% of its total employment. Despite podcasts' widespread appeal among listeners, it identified problems in making them viable. With a resolute poem about surviving, Megan closed up the 12th installment of the Archetypes podcast series but she made no hint of a potential second season. She paraphrased the Greek post-war poet Dinos Chrysianopoulos as she closed the concert, which included males for the first time, and asked, What didn't you do to bury me? But you failed to remember that I was a seed. The royal couple's production form, Archwell, is now being discussed in regards to publishing further content, according to the newspaper. Additionally, there are rumors that Meghan may soon consider expanding her health and lifestyle website, The TIG, in an effort to compete with GWYNTH Paltrow's Goop, which is said to be worth £200 million. The Duke and Duchess have sought a variety of alternative options to make money after formally quitting the royal family and relocating to California in 2020. Included in this is Prince Harry's shocking autobiography Spare which he wrote as part of a $20 million agreement with Penguin Books. Additionally, the couple collaborated with Netflix to create the six-episode docuseries titled Harry and Meghan, for which the streaming service allegedly paid the couple $100 million.